everybody, what's up? This is Vince Papali coming at you once again with your Invincible Insight of the Week. And I figured I'd do this when, uh, you know, sort of special to my wife. Uh, we're celebrating our 30th wedding anniversary. And um, <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. I outkicked my coverage with Janet. And oh, by the way, you, you know, in, in the movie, they have her portrayed as a Giants fan. But in reality, she was world class gymnast and coach and and thank God she's come into my life 30 years ago. So, and I figured, you know, when you when you do something for 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 years in a row, uh, there's got to be something to that, you know. So I like to think that with 30 years, I've got an invincible marriage. So I, I just want to spend a minute or two just talking about, you know, what it takes uh, to have that invincible relationship. Uh, and it doesn't make a difference whether it's a spouse or whether it's a partner, whether it's a friend, whether it's in business. Uh, you know, whatever it may be, uh, being part of a team, for example, but you know, just a couple of pointers that uh, maybe will help you keep it together and, and make sure that the relationship that you have with whomever that person is, or whomever that team is, or that group, or that company, uh, or, your, or your client maybe, whoever that is, that it just continues. And you know, one of them, of course, it takes tenacity. <laughs> you know, you, you do really do have to stay with it. And, and if anything, uh, you know, patience without a doubt, you know, to be invincible and have that, let's call it an invincible team. You've got to have that patience. And, and along with that patience, you, you've got to be, you've got to be willing to make compromises, you know, and that, that's certainly part of that deal. You know, and with the compromises, uh, you've got to learn how to call the audible. You know, we always had this thing when we were playing ball, you know, we had what was called a sight adjustment. That was an audible between the quarterback and the wide receiver and nothing had to be said. Uh, and all it was, was, you know, if the quarterback saw that you're gone off and they're running a zone or man to man and the, the, the play that was called was for a zone and they're running a man to man defense that you automatically would have to make that sight adjustment uh, with the quarterback or quarterback to you to make the play, of course, happen. Well, you know what? It's, it's situational awareness and to be surviving in, in any kind of a relationship, you better be aware of what's going on around you. I mean, without a doubt, it's situational awareness. And the other thing, of course, is uh, making sure that the people that you're dealing with know that you care. You know, I mean, you're, you're not just there uh, as part of whatever you're part of. You're there because you care. And uh, obviously, you know, what, whatever it might be and wherever you are and whatever you're doing, you know, understanding what your role is and, you know, playing that role out with passion. Yeah, I'm, you know, I make the bed, you know, I have, I have no problem doing the dishes. I do the laundry. I mean, you know, it's what you do. And, uh, you know, it's those little things that help. And that's what I think being, you know, it's playing for the guy or the person next to you. You know, that's as simple as that. And then, uh, you know, communication. Uh, that absolutely is one of the key things. You've got to learn to communicate no matter what and, and understanding and, you know, appreciate the other person's point of view of uh, what doesn't agree with you. You know, maybe our politicians ought to think about something like that. And, um, and, and I'll just leave you with this. You know, get involved in the community. You get involved in the, you know, be helpful, make a difference in people's lives. I mean, all those things are, are really important. But I think what it all comes down to, and it's this one thing, and it's trust. You know, you've got to have trust. And if you don't have that, there is no relationship, no matter what it's about. It's got to be around trust. All right. So speaking of trust, there's the Papelli Group. And that's Janet and Gabrielle and Vinny, our real estate group. If you need any help for anything that you're doing, whether it's top dollar or whatever, 24-hour white glove concierge service, all you have to do is go to the papauigroup.com and they'll be there for you in either Florida, New Jersey, or Pennsylvania. So, hey, have an invincible week. Uh, fly Eagles fly, of course. It's really exciting with football season coming up right now. But more exciting than anything is the willingness to get together and to become a great teammate. See y'all. Have a great week. We'll talk to you again soon.